I'm at a point now where I think some of these rappers are trying to get arrested for bullshit on purpose. I mean, come on, man. Come on, man. You can't script this shit. Me and the Notification Gang would like to invite everybody to come join us Monday through Thursday, 9.20 to 10 o'clock for Morning Coffee, where we discuss the events of the prior day and also just talk mess about stuff. See you then. BBN, Jack Frost, what's up party people? Okay, so, look man, I don't understand it. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. I don't understand why rich, rich folk, especially rich minorities, they wanna conduct themselves like po niggas. I don't get it. All right, so Offset has been arrested once again. Uh, I believe he just was arrested recently too, wasn't he? Just just recently? Okay, so basically he was pulled over. He was pulled over. Uh, the, 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 they were always throwing out different reasons why they're pulling people over. No matter what race, color, ethnicity, uh, religion you are, <laughs> gender... They always throw out like different reasons why somebody's getting pulled over. Um, I think they pulled him over, pulled him over because they said his tints were too dark, and then I heard somewhere because he was weaving. I don't know, but let's say the tints were too dark. Things that's something that can't be controlled. Let's just be honest. If you were weaving, you probably was intoxicated and fucked up driving. That I mean, you just had to not be intoxicated and drive. <laughs> <laughs> what I mean, you know, most artists spend most of their time being high and drunk, so that's it. there's nothing you can do about that. But um, the thing that kills me, and this is just something that I just 100% don't understand. You're rich. You don't have to drive your own car. Anyway, so Offset was arrested. Uh, they found a gun in the car, so hey, go figure. They found some weed in the car. And they, I think also for some kind of traffic problem, I think there's, there's something wrong with his license. His license. Something was wrong with his license. So, yeah, that's what he's being arrested for. But for everybody that don't know, Offset is a convicted felon. Right? So, besides the fact that he's a convicted felon and he's, he's, he's currently, he's currently on probation. <laughs> Currently, he's definitely not supposed to be driving around with weed in the car. And he's, I'm going to assume isn't supposed to be around no guns at all. But, you know, when you're a rapper. So, my whole thing to say is I don't understand. Like, you're rich. You have money. Somebody else can drive your car. You don't have to weave in and out of traffic if that's what it was. You're rich. You have money. Don't have the tents too dark. You know you don't want the police to just be fucking with you just to be fucking with you. This is the shit I don't understand. Look, I get it. I get it. Okay, let me let me not say I don't understand, but I do get it. You, you, you haven't so much handed to you because you have a, a talent that a lot of people admire and appreciate. So you've afforded yourself the opportunity to live a certain lifestyle. And that particular lifestyle in which you afforded yourself the opportunity to live comes with perks. I get it. But guess what? The law don't care. Now, is it me or, or people constantly getting picked up in Georgia for uh, on the road? They're the Georgia police are constantly stopping people on the road. What? Constantly. Like, whenever there's some kind of, like, break, and, you know, they've, they've arrested somebody, they would look. It seems like they just found this dude on the road. How did they find Georgia and Florida? Those those two states, they're constantly, it's always a traffic stop, and they found somebody. How did they find the XXX Tentacion, uh, the Diedrich Williams guy? It was a traffic stop. So please, you're rich. You have tons of money. Not only can you get somebody to drive your car, but if you feel like you need to have guns with you, you can have a different car with another individual driving that one with the weapons. 
This is what I don't understand. You know, you don't hear about having problems like this. Jay Z. You know, you don't hear about having problems like this. Nas. I don't even think Drake has problems like this. That would absolutely surprise me. And I think I heard about Drake having problems with the police for some different reason. But that that could have just uh, I, that could have been I don't know in a dream or some shit. Maybe that didn't happen. But anyway, the point being is this. Dude's already a felon. He just got caught with weapons. He just got caught with drugs. We see what happens from here. Let's hope hope for the best. And when I say hope for the best, I don't just mean that he doesn't get a lot of time or or they don't revoke his probation or, or anything like that. I'm saying let's hope for the best that he learns and other people also learn in, in around in the situation. And we can stop having our celebrities getting arrested for being stupid. That basically is why he got arrested, right? For being stupid. Anyway. Leave it down in the comment section. I want to know what you guys think about it. Am I wrong? I mean, I might be wrong. Maybe I'm just either not giving him enough credit or giving him too much credit. I guess it depends on... I guess I guess it depends on how much you like his music, depending on what point or what side of that, what side of that seesaw you're going to be on. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Join the notification gang. Hashtag Bronx Bombers. Let's get it. I love y'all. Take care of each other. Hug the kids for me. I haven't forgot about you. And that's all I got on this one. I'm out. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you would like to help dictate the direction that this channel takes, please leave a comment. All comments are appreciated, whether positive or negative. Thank you very much and enjoy your day. And remember, positive thoughts cause for positive things to happen. Let's get it.